all right my people welcome back onto this channel thanks so much for subscribing to this channel our prayer has been that the good lord will continue to support you all in all your endeavors as you keep supporting this channel amen all right my people many things don't happen many things don't share it do a nation no going back that's what the people are still talking about well on to this one a lot had happened and then hmm professor banji akinto ye releases a very strong prayer for the movement with dual nation actualization all right and then they call this a prayer meeting and then this prayer meeting a lot of agitators were present at this meeting hmm somebody like uh far area more roof uh pancare oro and the uh, many others were you no know, in attendance and then onto this a lot of things were said but most especially professor banji akinto ye actually prayed for the movement and then it was so awesome you no know, listening and then watching the event the meeting and then you will know that these people are actually for for a good mission yes and then that's what we have seen so far on to this and then with you no know, little things i could you no know, be able to you know fathom you no know, recall out from what they actually said hmm. and then from what professor banji akinto ye said he actually prayed for a better nation he actually prayed for uh, a great actualization of yoruba nation and then at the same time he talked about the fact that you no know, let everyone let every parent pray for their children because this time around hmm, the country itself they call it the location 419 hmm, as they fondly call it that this country as it stands hmm, does not mean well for the people that's why you will see a lot of you no know, uh yoruba children this time around going astray that's why you see some set of children trying to use their own parents for rituals simply because of the gift the kind of gift the country nigeria has not given to them <laughs> all right so and then he said a lot of things about the fact that we have some elites in the yoruba terrain that are supposed to come out these are no notable people who are supposed to come out to fight for the movement but this set of people instead of this set of people coming out to say oh we want to fight for our own we want to talk about the movement they are rich they are public figures they are not well to do a lot of people expect them but they are not ready to come out hmm. is it because of fear or something and they said that it is only the good lord that will touch the heart of these people so that at least the movement will move faster okay and then at the same time hmm, professor banji akintoye actually prayed for some set of people who are so poly political about this movement talking about some yorubas who are you no know, no after the movement of you no know, the location for one and they are not even thinking of how yoruba nation will be actualized what they are after is the political terrain of the location for one night oh my goodness all right and then onto this he had been able to pray that the good lord in no time will touch the heart of these ones all right so and then another thing he actually said that the movement uh the urban nation movement that people will not see any way that will make them to compromise will not see any form that will make them to say oh we are tired of this that the good lord will continue to give them the enablement to you know, follow it up the way it is hmm yoruba nation will be back as yoruba nation according to what professor banji akintoye actually said also yoruba nation creates a civilization that you and the uh, you and uh, every other person definitely will enjoy and uh, he said something about the you know, the goal of the yoruba nation and uh, he said oh, this uh, yoruba nation you no know, actualization the yoruba nation goal is to you no know, bring out a kind of civilization that you no know, every other black african countries will 
envy hmm. that's another serious one i had I, I actually picked from that prayer meeting hmm. prosperity will return to yoruba nation wishing professor banji akintoye at the end of the meeting wishing him a long life hmm, because he just celebrated his birthday well my people <laughs> a lot of things were actually said and then at the end of the day we noticed we you know watched the part whereby pankere oro pankere oro right now actually prayed for professor banji akinto and then from what he actually said he talked about the fact that professor banji akinto even at his age he is still doing the right thing hmm. not like some other set of you no know, leaders that uh, people are praying for their death but for somebody like professor banji akinto he will live long 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 in this earth that every year we will continue to see him because he's one of the you no know, great people that god has put in the you known land of yorubas just to fight for the yorubas that he is the moses of the yoruba time and then you know, when you take a look at it when looking at his you no know, professor banji akinstoye's age looking at his picture looking at the way he's so energetic that is to tell you that doing good will definitely make you to live long okay and uh, he said that they will continue to pray for professor banji akinto you not for other you no know, uh, leaders that people are praying for their death okay my people this is another strong one all right oh and then well and then majority of people actually you no know, reacted you no know, in in different forms onto this one and uh, they have been able to you know pray for the movements or the dual nation no going back and then uh, that's exactly what it is all right and uh, meanwhile professor banji akintoye also talked about the fact that the horrible things that you no know, are happening to the yoruba land right now is as a result of the gift of nigeria to the yoruba people and then we are praying our prayer according to him is that god will conquer this all right my people i think you no know, prayers is so paramount also in everything you do because if there is no god in whatsoever you do my people i'm not sure in that kind of a thing you will succeed well it might just take time it might be a matter of time but definitely when you put god first in everything you do you will definitely succeed all right and then another one i just have to know i just remembered right now that he talked about is the fact that he said there are some set of people though these people do not have the capability to come out like in person or you no know, with their fund or anything to support the movement but they are trying their best on the social media aspect by posting you no know, news by talking about the good thing that's about to happen by telling people about how your urban nation will be actualized he said so to those ones also that he is praying that the good lord will continue to bless them and give them the enablement the courage to do more on social media all right my people onto this yoruba nation no going back that's what the people are talking about all right my people and this is what it is right now onto this meanwhile let me have your take on this my people and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are new on this channel all right thanks and god bless